So a very fundamental, critical component of training and recovery is nutrient timing. An excellent book I recommend is Nutrient Timing by Portman and Ivy, getting to some of the very important fundamentals of this. I want to share with you the three phases of nutrient timing because I tell you, as an expert in the field, I see most athletes and people who train violate this day in and day out. And it's like you, it, it's irresponsible to even train unless you are nutrient timing. So let's talk about nutrient timing. There are three basic phases. The first phase is the energy phase. What I want to do is actually read to you from the book what these phases and what these components are all about. This phase is approximately 10 minutes before your training and during your training. It's at this point you want to increase nutrient delivery to muscles and spare muscle glycogen and protein. Very important, muscle glycogen is the fuel that most muscles are going to use during a typical workout. Number two, you want to limit the immune system suppression. That's right, if you're training on an empty stomach, you're burning muscle for fuel, you're reducing glutamine in the body, you're burning up your branch chain amino acids, which will absolutely suppress the immune system. That's called sickness. Lost time in the gym, poor performance. Third, minimize muscle damage. So of course you don't want to overtrain, but while you're training breaking down muscle, you want to get like a little time release of nutrients to your actual muscle. So before and during training, it's important to make sure you're getting them some fuel. And you want to set the nutritional stage for a faster recovery following your workout. Very important to make sure you go right into the second phase properly, which is the anabolic phase, number two. And we know that anabolic means building up. And this lasts for about 45 minutes after a typical workout. We've heard about this window of opportunity. So this window of opportunity is very important. You want to shift from a catabolic to an anabolic state. Replenish muscle glycogen, initiate tissue growth and repair. And we do this through high quality whey protein, is my favorite because it's the fastest releasing, and a good carbohydrate mixture, and also often vitamins and minerals and other factors such as your branch chains and glutamine. And the third phase is the growth phase. That's from workout to workout. That's where you're eating clean, getting your protein, making sure you're not in amino acid deficiency, getting proper carbohydrates, getting your fluids, and resting. So the principles of nutrient timing, energy phase, anabolic phase, growth phase. It is a system. Don't violate this. When you put proper training and nutrient timing, bigger, faster, stronger, leaner, immune system, you're going to feel great. So implement that immediately.